What's up guys, Spin Firearms here, and today I'm gonna to be doing my first impression. Um, basically what I think of the slide that I just received from Brownells. Um, I do not have my new Glock 26 frame. Uh, it's for that ported build. Um, the build where I got the ported barrel and the ported slide to go with it. We're gonna see, does it make a big difference in a Glock? Does it make a big difference in a Glock 26 specifically? Anyways, since I don't have the frame yet, it's still on its way. Um, I put it on my other build's frame. And honestly, it looks really nice. You have the front and rear serrations um, like a Gen 5 does, although they are different serrations. They are not spot on. On top of that, it's optic ready. This is the Brownell slide. Um, I got it for a pretty good deal on eBay, actually. They sent out coupons, so I used it, and this is what I got. Now, the cover plate, I know it looks ugly, and it's not going to stay there because I am going to be putting optics on this. But it is like a composite material, so it's much lighter. It honestly feels like nothing. And it's basically just to uh, fill the spot, make sure, you know, it doesn't get gunked up and, you know, whatever. You don't really need it, but I put it on there. And also, I don't have sights on here yet because I still don't know which sights I'm going to do. Um, they got to be suppressor height sights if I order optics for it. Anyways, that is the slide. Check it out. That's the porting. So the barrel I got to go with this, the porting lines up perfectly. It's three holes right there that match up dead on with this Brownell slide, which is awesome. Right now though, if you're curious about the barrel, that is the Hooper Gunworks fluted barrel, one of the most accurate barrels that I've ever used in my Glock 26s, um, and they're for a good price. I think they're like $110 or something like that. Very nice, they save weight, very accurate. Anyways, and then this is this side. So we do have a Glock upper parts kit in this thing, um, and I did put a, a back plate on it. No big deal, um, but this isn't gonna be how the build stays. Obviously, I gotta add the sights. Um, and the barrel is going to be ported, which is the whole point of this build. They're just pretty behind on their shipping. Anyways, I like it. It has a nice finish on it. I have seen some mixed reviews on the Brownell slides, mostly good reviews though. Um, and so far, it's smooth. It racks nice. It, it you know, obviously it's a drop on drop in slide, fit perfectly. And I mean, it, you can't beat the porting and how it looks. Now, I don't like carrying ported barrels. I just, I just have a thing about my firearms getting really dirty because of you know my activities and I just don't want you know stuff to just gunk up and build in my firearms obviously you clean them but I don't get around to cleaning my firearms every day even every week for that matter so um, anyways you can see the front is different too really like that it's a really nice look I think it's a good slide it's from a good company um, and if you need something ported that's the way to go and also optics ready you can't beat it I think it was like $190 or something like that and it runs smooth so can't complain um, so stay tuned guys, we'll have the finished ported um, build and we'll see how the porting actually does, if it really messes with recoil, if it doesn't, or if it makes malfunctions start to occur. So anyways, I'll keep you guys updated uh, with the finished product. Thanks for watching.